of our university. To be a research university, to be a research committed to the uh, social, economic, uh, cultural, uh, scientific development is something that uh, we cannot reach if uh, we don't have internationalization as a, a, a main object of our, our activity. And uh, uh, for us, this is this is quite quite clear. Uh, of course, uh, that in this in this process, we don't forget that we are in Europe. So the European higher education area is the major focus that uh, we uh, selected for our internationalization strategy. But uh, in those, we, we never forget some other uh, important uh, aspects of our circumstance. As, as you may know, uh, Portugal, long last centuries, uh, developed very close links with uh, countries that are countries now from South America, from uh, Africa, and from uh, Asia being some of these countries uh, former colonies of, of Portugal. In spite of that, the fact that it was possible for Portugal to keep uh, uh, good relations with all those countries, and of course it is impossible for a university like the University of Minho in Portugal to forget the fact that we have historically and that we have today very close links with some of these of these nations. And so our strategy also selects as target Asia, Africa, and South America. In this context, uh, it is easy to understand, I think, how relevant for us is to have you here with us uh, uh, today. To have you here is uh, a means of consolidating our international relations, of strengthening links with the, the universities, with institutions from where you uh, you, you, you came uh, or you come, uh, and for, for 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 these reasons, uh, it, it is as I, as I mentioned of great relevance for us to have the the the, the conference and this meeting of the steering committee uh, uh, here at the University of Minho. But of course, it's also important because of the object uh, uh, of the meeting. It is uh, impossible for the, the, the universities, for the higher education, uh, the other education institutions, not to consider those uh, uh, that are the main challenges that our nations, our societies, our world is facing today. And the, the issue of sustainability is a major issue. And that's another reason, because we are also committed with this kind of goals. This is another reason to be uh, very happy with your presence here. So, Thank you uh, for coming, and uh, I hope that you have uh, today a, a very good and productive journey, and of course that tomorrow uh, the conference, I'm sure it will correspond to your best expectations. So thank you very much. Uh, thank you, Professor Rui Pera de Castro, uh, Director, Universidad de Minho, uh, for your welcome remarks. Uh, now, may I invite uh, Professor Riri Fitrisari, uh, the chairperson of UI Green Metric, uh, to say a few words to welcome all of us. Right. Thank you very much, Pajunaidi, uh, Honorable Rector, Professor. Um, uh, Rui Piera de Castro, Rector of Universidad Domino, Portugal. Thank you very much for your welcome speech uh, and to welcome all of us in your beautiful university in a very sunny weather. <laughs> Mind you, I take the sun with me from home. Yes, yes. <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> 
Right, yeah. Uh, welcome, all friends. Uh, it's just like meeting all friends from all over the world. Uh, more than 20 countries represented here uh, with all the active national coordinators. So I really uh, thank all of you for uh, taking your time and taking a long trip. But I'm sure that we will make the most of this uh, opportunity to meet uh, and to uh, make sure that uh, we are exchanging information, exchanging ideas, and also uh, creating future collaborations and programs that are beneficial for our future, for our students, for our next generation, and of, of course, to ensure that our university are going from one stage to another uh, improvement. So um, actually, uh, we have been planning to have this meeting for quite some time. We missed the meeting last year in um, uh, Taiwan. We're supposed to see the very green university, but hopefully we will meet. Uh, never know, you know, uh, because all of us have agenda. For example, Professor uh, Castro here have uh, the 50th uh, anniversary of the university. I think big uh, meetings like this can only be conducted uh, with uh, a lot of effort uh, in which we uh, are trying to show up. I thank all university presidents. We have Professor Ban Chong from Mahidol University, the rector of uh, Mahidol University, who has been very active every year. He has been with us also uh, with uh, UI Green Metric uh, Taiwanese uh, meeting. And uh, actually, from the, the front, Professor Anatozi, thank you for the meeting two weeks ago in Italy, we have our friends at uh, L'Aquila University, and I know that you have a lot of fruitful discussion. Yeah, you're also from? No, oh, yes, yeah, I remember, yeah, uh, Miguel, yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, Ricardo, yes, no, always sorry about, yeah, uh, Ricardo and Miguel Banderas. And also, uh, we have our friend from Uzbekistan, uh, Professor uh, Ukhor. And also we have our friend from uh, uh, Mahido, Professor Kitty Korn. Yes, thank you. And in the uh, back there, uh, we have Maria from University College Cork, our previous um, host for our meeting in 2017, if I'm not, 19, <laughs> exactly before the pandemic situation. It was a very beautiful memory. And also we have our uh, national coordinator. If you can stand up, Jaime from Ecuador. Colombia, Colombia. Colombia. Sorry, I always. <laughs> yeah, thank you for your coffee. <laughs> but uh, thank you. You will organize a meeting in next two week, uh, two months. Yeah, in September in uh, in, Colombia. in Colombia. Yeah. Okay. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Yes. Okay. Thank you. Yeah. And next year our meeting will be hosted by Colombia. Adversario. Yes, thank you. And we have Professor um, Amber from uh, University of Diponegoro, the previous host. If you remember uh, Doro Budur when he took us there together in Java, uh, it was uh, 2000 and uh, a long time ago. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> thank you so much. And next we have. Uh, Professor Nav from Navarra University, Cristina um, Ponzini, yeah? From Spain. Yeah, from Spain, from Spain, Navarra University. Next, we have our friend from Brazil. Brazil. Uh, yeah, uh, can you stand up? Yeah, Pena, yeah? yeah? Yeah, thank you from University of Sao Paulo. They are hosting our online course. And our very good friend, uh, Professor Patricia, will be here next uh, tonight, yeah? And in the back, oh yeah, Vincent, uh, can you stand up, Vincent, our friend from Taiwan, from then PUSD, he's been uh, back up, yeah, uh, thank you so much. Uh, next, uh, our friend from Poland, uh, if you could stand up, um, yeah, and, uh, your Fidel, yeah, Anna Fidel, yeah, from Adam Miscavige University in Poland. So this is like United Nations, you know. <laughs> exactly. And in the back there, I cannot see. Rafael, can you stand up? From Esposh, uh, Simborazo, from the highest place in the world, uh, from Mountain Simborazo. 
director. And our the vice director of Simbo Razov, can you stand up, sir? Yes. Thank you for coming. Uh, we have vice director. And also from United Arab Emirates, uh, Shera. Professor Sarah is from uh, Sarjia University. She's been very involved in our online course. Thank you. And in the back there, we have our friends from Pax Hungary. Thank you, Tunde, for always be with us with her uh, intern and also daughter. Thank you so much. Uh -huh. <laughs> and next, we have friends from Samarang, uh, yeah, from Undip. And anyone else? Uh, yeah, we have from, Braga. oh, yeah, you're from Braga University. Braga. Yes. Thank you so much. I mentioned my colleagues. Oh, sure. Yeah. Yes. If you, if I may. Yes, please. Can, can yes. you introduce? Just, yeah. Yes. Um, thank you very much for this yes. not very orthodox yes. uh, <laughs> interruption. Just to mention uh, two people in, the, in their teams that were absolutely fundamental for development of the conference here and steering committee. Uh, Miguel Bandeira, Professor Miguel Bandeira. Uh, is a member of the director team of the university, as is the Professor Guilherme Pereira, that was uh, with his team the body and soul body of, and this, soul. of this, uh, of this sure, meeting. Sure. Uh, and we have with us also uh, uh, Dr. Ricardo Lubão, will, I think, will present some results of the, of the, of the university. Uh, I, uh, I'm very Grateful to, to them for for the, for the efforts that they put in the organization of this of this conference. So I'd like to publicly acknowledge yes. that. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you, Professor Castro, and we have introduced all our friends today. So uh, next agenda is adoption of yeah. The, if you would read that, yeah. Uh, thank you, Professor Lee, yes. for the welcome remarks. No, I think uh, I can stay the, longer. Uh, the, the, the purpose Maybe we'll of you this meeting is to discuss the uh, activities in each country and agree on the activities of 2023, yes. okay. as well as uh, other matters related to the network. So, uh, with your participation, uh, this is we hope we can discuss uh, important questions related to the roles of universities in global sustainability issues and aims to encourage universities worldwide to collaborate and learn from each other uh, in dealing with sustainability issues. So for that, uh, all of you have the agenda. Um, so we will start with the adoption of the minute uh, of last year in National Thinking University of Science, and then followed by the country report in which uh, each of you will uh, present your country report for about um, seven or two ten 10 minutes uh, for each of you. And then after that, we will have our discussions of uh, future activities of the green metric. Can we all agree on the agenda? Thank you very much. Thank you. Uh, next. Uh, is the adoptions of the minutes of the sixth steering committee meeting meeting sorry so all of you have uh, if you could look at the uh, minutes of the meeting um, um, of the sixth steering committee meeting uh, in this meeting uh, we agree uh, to do some activities together so for example, in the area of shaping global higher education and research in sustainability, um, we agree that the international workshop of UI Green Metric uh, 2023 will be hosted by University of the Minho in Portugal. So here we are. Uh, and then uh, there were, uh, there are activities in a workshop in Colombia, in Indonesia, in Russia, Uzbekistan, and Ecuador. Uh, I believe we have the date uh, for all these workshops. 
and in the area of creating global sustainability leaders uh, we will have international student leaders meeting 2023 uh, this will be hosted by Bukhara State University, Professor Abdul, uh, who will host uh, the first International Student Leaders Meeting. And for the International Sustainability, uh, uh, maybe not student leader, but this is a, a International Student Sustainability Student Leader Meeting will be hosted by Bukhara International Sustainability Leaders Meeting will be hosted by Otsin Technical University in Ankara, Turkey. Uh, and then online course on sustainability team one, um, hosted by seven university and University of Sao Paulo, Brazil uh, is the uh, coordinator for online course team one. And for online course on sustainability team two, uh, National Kingston University of Science and Technology, uh, Professor Pinson uh, it, um, and his team uh, is the coordinator. Uh, on, in the area of partnering on solutions to sustainability challenges, we will have uh, the first world, uh, second World Sustainable Campus Tour uh, will be hosted by University of Sarja, uh, United Arab Emirates. And then uh, we haven't uh, had this joint research on sustainability. So perhaps this is the area that we can discuss together uh, today. And also international community services on sustainability. And the meeting was adjourned at 9.30 p.m. Can we adopt the six, uh, the minutes of 16 committee meeting? Thank you. <laughs> now, uh, let's move on to the next uh, agenda, uh, which is the country report of 2023. So, um, to start with, may I invite uh, Professor Miguel Bandera, Director for Sustainability, uh, University of Minho, uh, Portugal, to report. Uh, uh, the activities uh, in Portugal. Uh, Professor Banera, the floor is yours. Thank you, Dr. John Manley, Vice Chair. I um, start to uh, um, uh, compliment the Professor uh, Riri Fitrisari. Uh, nice to meet you. It's a pleasure for me to, uh, to meet you and the uh, uh, stay here for uh, to uh, present it, the, um, uh, our report. Um, well, um, um, good afternoon, uh, everyone. I would like uh, would like to begin uh, by welcoming all the members of the EU Green Metric World University Rankings, special today, um, the, and the, particularly the, the coordinators of the steering committee meeting. Um, I uh, wish my uh, presentation with um, um, engineer Ricardo Louvain, um, is the um, uh, director of technical services at uh, our university, oversee these um, sectors. Um, I am the proctor, uh, well, uh, as our rector uh, already mentioned it. Uh, but uh, um, the uh, science uh, beginning this year, uh, uh, I am Prorector for Sustainability and um, Management of the, the Campi uh, uh, of the University of Me. Um, just I, I would like to say a few words about uh, our position in this context. Um, our author uh, uh, said the, the most important, but uh, I, I want to uh, focus in the, I think in the three or four um, uh, conditions of our context. Uh, our university, which brings together around 33,000 people, 
being the largest uh, new university in the country, in Portugal, is physically uh, distributed for across two of the oldest uh, cities in Portugal, in the densely, uh, densely population, populated region uh, of uh, our country, with uh, some of the most uh, auspicious uh, demographic indicators in the territory. Uh, for example, uh, Braga and Guimarães uh, was uh, uh, few years uh, ago um, the, the most young cities in the world. Uh, uh, present, no, uh, but the region is the, the most younger in, the, in, uh, in Portugal and the more density in people. Um, it um, occupies three campuses, the most recent of which is located in the historic center uh, of Guimarães, our symbolic cradle uh, of the Portuguese nation. Symbolic, but also is an important place to, to interact the, the community and the university. Is, uh, uh, a great challenge uh, for both uh, uh, the institutions, the municipality yeah, and the university. Um, the university of me played the pioneering role in the implementation of sustainable, uh, sustainability on the university campus and is today committed to relaunching its way of being and uh, its development projects in the integrated uh, perspective of the nation, United Nations 2030 Sustainable Development Goals. It's for us is uh, very important. The, uh, a global vision uh, beyond the, the sustainability the, uh, and also the society and um, and um, the economy. Actually, could I make it? Yeah. Uh, just to one or our, our, our uh, previous um, um, comments, uh, it's always important to to specify our vision in the university. Um, our the greatness and scope of these objectives, we are committed to in changing the universally universalist vocations of universities. That is, universities, by the nature of the mission, constitute in themselves one of the main focus of creativity and innovation in measures and actions in favor of sustainable development. Universities must be the main exemplary reference of a good practice in the communities where they are inserted and interact with them more and more uh, proximately. And uh, the, the three uh, consideration is the, uh, for us is the university should be the main tester centers for the desirable process of social, environment, environmental and economic transition. It's uh, a priority of our mission. Um, Every day, we produce knowledge and promote actions within the scope of the 17 goals for the sustainable developments. Just then, uh, as an example, in these last few weeks, uh, the first uh, 15 days of the month, the following ev events were announced uh, and held, but uh, I, um, I uh, now I don't uh, you, uh, what's it uh, bother, 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 bother with us tomorrow in my presentation. I, I made it up, but uh, now I share the, um, my intervention with the engineer, um, Ricardo Louvain, is the director of technical service, and uh, we presented our goals in these areas, especially. Uh, Possibly in the, the goals of the green metrics um, um, mission. Okay, thank you. Thank okay. you.
Thank you very much. Thank you. It's very um, I, I, my name is Hilda. It's a pleasure to be here in all of you. It's a lunch. It's my first time here. So um, I just will try to explain what we have done in 2022 in the Green Medical Program University of Um Just to say that in KDGB, we have to mean university further enhance collaboration with companies on various sustainable related projects. In terms of academic cooperation, we managed to make contributions for better eco conscious life by strengthening higher diversity within Stanford facilities. So, we have several activities that we, we, we implemented um, last year. Um, I'll try to remember some of them. Uh, I think our most important one that we implemented. So, one that we, one 